important to me to go out on gigs because it's that interaction then with the audience. You know, I love being in the studio, but I also love gigging. And the two just do sit perfectly alongside, obviously, because you get to do all the creative side of it in the studio and around the new albums and makings and creations, you know. And, and that thing of getting to get the audience reaction to something that you've been creating and working on for months and months behind closed doors, you know, in secret is always a lovely moment. Yeah, love it. I saw the sheep share the corners fall out. I saw the sheep share the corners saw the bird blow the ball. Thou wast well drunk man, who's the fool now? Thou wast well drunk man, who's the fool now? The band we have at the moment is just amazing. Not only are they amazing players, every one of them is a real genius and a real craftsman on their instruments that they play, but each one of them also is a great creator as well, away from my stuff and you know they've all got their individual careers and they're always working and creating and coming up with new ways to do things, which is why it's so exciting to work with them. And not only that, is they're all so lovely. Just every one of them is a proper friend, you know, and it's just a, such a pleasure to come out on the road because there's nothing worse than touring with people who you don't like because that's a rubbish job. But I'm dead lucky, you know. And also, the office side of it, I mean, our, um, my younger brother Joe is doing, does the sound, has done it, crikey, 18 years or something now. He was only tiny when he first started out with me, but it's what my dad used to do, was a sound engineer, so that's where Joe learnt it. But, um, so we've even got family on tour, and of course Damien's in the band, who's my husband, and even the office side of it at Pure Records, which is our own label, it's my dad and my mum does the accounts and my sister works at the office as well, you know doing like the PR stuff and loads of stuff and, and there's, there's Joy as well who's the only one who's not a member of the family but we've kind of taken her in now as well, she's brilliant, she's amazing. So even that side of it, you know, it's a real lovely atmosphere because it's all safe and you know nobody's ripping you off and you know everybody's got the same goal at the end of the day, you know, and everybody wants to keep everybody happy, that's the other thing. We always, you know, one of the mottos is just be nice. And it seems to just be like that. Everybody around us at the moment is really, really lovely, which is just, it's, it's brilliant. Yeah, that's really great. And of course, the music business is renowned for being like so cutthroat and horrible and, you know, but we've been able to control all the bits, the rights to the songs, when we do an album, who we work with. And that's such a luxury as a musician, really, to be able to do all that and have our own studio, you know, that's the, first thing we did with any money we made, we put it into getting studio equipment which has built up over the years. So yeah, dead lucky. Lucky girl. Mm -hmm.